On September 12, 2022, PNB Rock was robbed and fatally shot at Roscoe's House of Chicken and Waffles near Main Street and Manchester Avenue in Los Angeles. Rakim Hashim Allen, better known by his stage name PNB Rock, was an American rapper and singer from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. He was best known for his single Selfish, which peaked at number 51 on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100. The musician, 30, was with his girlfriend when a gunman reportedly demanded jewelry before opening fire inside a Waffle House in the south of the city. Police found PNB with multiple gunshot wounds and he was pronounced dead in hospital 45 minutes later. PNB Rock had two daughters, born in 2013 and 2020, the latter born to Stephanie Sibanuong. Rakim Hashim Allen was born on December 9, 1991, in the Germantown neighborhood of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Allen's father was murdered when he was three years old, so he was primarily raised by his mother. In his teen years, he lived in northeast Philadelphia. 6. He grew up listening to rapper Tupac and Ranby group Jodeci. At the age of 13, Allen was sent to a youth detention program for committing robberies and fighting in school. When he turned 19, he was sentenced to 33 months in prison for drug possession and other crimes. Allen was homeless for a short period after being released from prison. He never finished high school. Allen later adopted the stage name PNB Rock, which paid homage to Pastorius and Bainton, a street corner near where he grew up in the Philadelphia neighborhood of Germantown. PNB Rock's debut mixtape, Real Nigga Bangas, which was written while he was jailed, was released on June 24, 2014. He entered into a recording contract with Atlantic Records in 2015, and the company published his third mixtape, R&B 3, as his debut project. He released the massively popular tune Selfish in June 2016. Through Atlantic Records and Empire Distribution, he released GTTM, Going Through the Motions, his second retail mixtape album, on January 10, 2017. Then, in April 2017, he contributed two tracks, Gang Up in a Boogie Wit to Hoodie, to the soundtrack of The Fate of the Furious. In May 2019, Trap Star Turned Pop Star, his debut album, was released. He released the track Backseat with Pop Smoke and was a featured artist on Ed Sheeran's Cross Me. In January 2020, he released the song Ordinary, which included the late rapper Pop Smoke. In January 2021, he released the song Rose Gold, which also featured the late rapper, King Von. He released a new mixtape called SoundCloud Days in February 2022. Before his death, he had an estimated net worth of about $3 million. Let's look at the fancy automobiles that PNB Rock had in his garage because he loved cars very much. He had pricey vehicles including the Lamborghini Huracan, Bentley Mulsanne, BMW 7 Series, Rolls-Royce Dawn, Ferrari 458 Italia, and more. PNB Rock was included in Rolling Stone's list of the 10 new artists you need to know in 2016. He was selected for the XXL freshman class the ensuing year. Rappers Young Thug, 2 Chains, and Wiz Khalifa all contributed to PNB Rock's 2017 hit Gang Up. Along with Kodak Black and A Boogie, he appeared in the song Horses. In November 2017, PNB released its first studio album, Catch These Vibes. On the Billboard 200, it peaked at number 17. The singles feelings and issues with Russ served as the album's promotional vehicles. PNB began dating Stephanie Sibanuang, a prominent figure on social media. But after dating for two years, they made the decision to break up. PNB Rock had a daughter named Milan Allen in October 2013 by the time he was 21 years old. PNB and Milan's mother split up following Milan's birth. Thank you for watching our video. Please like our video and subscribe to our channel.